Hi everyone, it's me. I'm sorry I've been gone for so long. Last year was a little hectic for me. It, I've been really busy with work and then I have to change um, positions where now I can finally have time to create more videos for you guys. So I hope I did not keep you waiting and don't forget to make sure you hit the like and subscribe button down below and hopefully let's get this started. I hope everyone is doing okay and ready for some videos from me. All right, so um, today I'll be using the a new product from Benefit Cosmetics. It's called the Bo Ying Ying. And I'm not sure if I pronounce it right, but um, if any one of you know about this, it's called the Benefit Cakeless Concealer. I received this for free and as uh, from Influencer. And I get this uh, cake lace concealer, full coverage liquid concealer. It is the, it does not cake or crack, hides blemishes, discoloration, and dark circles. Um, I don't think I have that much dark circles on my eyes. I use some eye creams, but I do have a lot of blemishes, and hopefully, it will help. It's lightweight, natural finish formula now available in 30 shades 24 hour long wear and waterproof Ooh, this would be good for the beach and then instrumental test on 20 participants and then another instrumental test on 22 participants i'm not sure why they write it down but all right so let's get started um it's been a really long time since i've put makeup so hopefully i did not get rested um, I will be using the Flower In Your Prime Pore Minimizing Primer by Flower Beauty, Drew Barrymore. <laughs> so let me, uh, tonight I want to be creative and don't mind my back is full with jackets. I am in our jacket closet that it's big enough for closet storage and also my makeup room so yes and today i will be using for my eyeshadows are gonna be the i have two new products from jeffrey cosmetics it's not totally brand new but it's brand new for me so it's called the bloodlust it's been out for many many years now probably but of course i just got them because you know i don't always follow up anymore i've been really busy for a long time so as you can see it's the bloodlust it's very velvet uh palette and i'm really excited it looks very classy Ooh. and also the um, the mirror, ooh, and then there's the cover, ooh, and then also I will have to take off the, I will have to show you guys, I don't want to show you like my reflection here, but as you can see, <laughs> it's a nice makeup, uh, and mirror, I mean, and I'm gonna be struggling a little bit here because I don't have that much room, but I'll do what I can. And hopefully, y'all understand. Okay. So, let's get started here. I'm going to put some of the primer. As you can see here. Ooh, it's green. I forgot. Mm-hmm. <laughs> So I hope everyone's doing okay and um, it's a new year and I hope that whatever is happening right now, it's going to be over soon because I just want to 
have a normal year. Like, we can't have a normal year. Like, even for just a year, maybe. Like, with all this craziness happening. So, I get my primer on. And then, let's see. By the way, guys, I have, like, burn from my... I was ironing my hair yesterday and I just did it all wrong. I don't know what happened there. And then I'm going to do this for my brows. And you can see how my brows are looking now. They're looking on point, I hope. And yeah, I haven't got done with my brows. I'm growing them. I, I like my thick brows. I, When I look back on my pictures before, like the, the thick brows or the thin brows, I mean, last couple of years was looking like, who is that? Anyway, let's get started. Um, I usually go first with face. Some have a different order, but we will start with the Benefit Cosmetics No Cake Foundation. Ooh, and it looks like very, it looks very cute. It looks like a pencil without a point. It's kind of like a moot point because then if you want to make it look like this is supposed to be an eraser, but you want to have a complete shape but it's okay because it will stand up though if you put it on a flat surface it will stand up so let's see doesn't smell bad okay oh my gosh it's really it's been a long time since i've done makeup this all felt weird right now um, I usually use, for my concealer, I have a mix. Um, I do like this for now. Oh, wow. Well, this way I can tell like how it actually looks like without anything else and this is how I do my concealers too um, so let's see I'm gonna try something different too uh, fixing spray and I'm gonna use a blender on the other side By the way, I use the Vesanti Concealer Buffer for my um, eyeshadow. Oh no, concealer. I'm gonna do both like that so I can have like an even makeup. But I'm also gonna tap it and have a just so we can see what it actually looks like depends on how you're gonna blend it yeah hmm. oh wow Oh wow, okay. Wow. Like, you don't see it. It just absorbs in your skin. That's amazing. Alright, so... There you have it. It actually absorbs. Oh wow. Wow, it absorbs, guys. So look at that. Looks natural to me. 
all right seriously so now that i'm done with the concealer i will use the oh maquillage or maquillage i've used this for a while but um, i usually don't talk about it until i've used it a couple times because then like how would you know that that's how it is the first time so i will use certain brush for it or maybe i'll just use the blending blending i will do this oh my gosh i feel like a noob by the way i'm using the i'm using i'm using this shade 85 woke up like this it's made in italy so i actually just like so they have a really like interesting like how you could get it because like first they let you try it and see how you like it and if you don't like it you can return and get your money back that i actually like i actually like it so i kept it and did not get my money back <sighs> yes that's true so I know my face is a little bit like white-ish, but my neck is the same color as my foundation. So I go for that. I don't go exactly like what my face looks like or my color because then you will have a different color on your neck. So I definitely have like I go for the darker shade and then I don't use this shade on winter because I, I get more I tend to be more lighter on winter and then ooh, this is beat to the beat I'm gonna go on like full coverage today it's definitely full coverage but that's fine gosh I really need to do my eyebrows huh so I have I know I already placed a layer of concealer but I'm gonna place another one on top and I bake sometimes and this time I'm gonna give it a try with the baking part So this time, it's going to be a little different, it's going to be, the process is a little different. When I put the foundation and then I put the concealer, I usually use a brush. And then I just tap them. I feel like it absorbs and blend better. There. Now I look like I have a line. And I just use the part of the blender that has the foundation because then it would just look like this so now it looks like that
it looks very natural. So I'm gonna um and you see that when you have this um whoa so in different lightings settings it could look like that so yeah all right so next is gonna be the eyebrows and we'll see how i do with my eyebrows because it's really it's really bushy and I'm gonna look like I have a line of my Okay, well, where's my eyebrows brush? And I cannot find it. Gosh, for all of the brushes that I have in here, I cannot seem to find my eyebrows brush. Where the heck it is? I guess I have to fix it somehow. A little disappointed of myself right now. Um, so let's see. Let's see. Okay, so I'm gonna use something and I'm gonna just clean it off using the concealer. Don't worry about the middle, because... Alright. 
so let's do this so eyebrows and then eyes done okay so let's get started with the eyeshadow of course i'm gonna use what mm, i think that i'm gonna start with the royal pain it's called the royal pain right here it's the royal pain that's my base It's definitely wow so you know what I can tell is that the camera does not do justice but right here it's just very nice it looks very smooth especially with the concealer as the as the base um, I feel really like it looks very smooth so I'm just gonna go up cause you know I'm gonna look like I really like that shade of the royal pain Oh. Hmm. The concealer is definitely not caking. This looks smooth. So now I'm going to go in with. I'm gonna use the brush that happened here. Okay, extra. Extra, extra, okay, extra. Okay, so I'm gonna use the Morphe M3030 M330. That's what I mean. I'm gonna use the the dungeon, which is right here. I'm, I can't tell exactly what the shade is. No, actually, I would go with the Blood Queen, which is the Blood Queen. It's going to be right. It's going to be the Blood Queen right there.
Wow. Jeffrey is highly pigmented. It's very pretty. It's blending really nicely. Wow. And I like to hold the brush in the very end because I want to do it as light as I can be. And then I'm going to go with the Executioner, which is a dark with some purple sh in it. Or purple shimmer. It's black. Gosh. Sorry guys, it's been a while since I do my makeup and I tend to like concentrate when I'm doing my makeup for now. Hmm. gonna add a little of the hiking so that it can blend so it will look like it's blending and not looking like a crazy person here No, it, it moves easily. That's what I, I feel like. It's just like it moves so quickly. But I'm going to do... I will clean that up in a little bit. I'm going to use something else for that because... Yes. And the concealer. I'm going to use this white foundation to clear that up. Yes, yes, I know what y'all talking about. I see that too. Hmm. I'm 
Okay, so now next is we're gonna hmm definitely we'll leave you with some creativity in here. And then I'm going to do the pink magic, which is this kind of pink magic. I don't even know what I'm doing right now, but I'm just winging it. Hmm. I would say that this palette has some great colors and some very, very pigmented quality of eyeshadows, but you have to like practice it or you have to be like a, a makeup artist to like really know how to control because the blending part is really hard. It's not that it's hard to blend or anything. It's just like the control. As you can see, like, look at this. Like, look at my eyeshadow. I don't think it, I mean, it's not the eyeshadow's fault. It's definitely me. And I just haven't worked on my makeup skills in a very long time. So I'm not putting hate on this don't hate me for it but i just have to work on my um skills and practice it oh by the way i'm using the vile serpent Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hmm. Okay, and then I'm going to use the Inner Corner Beauty Sleep to put inside. Ooh, it's a chrome actually. It's a dual chrome, so maybe not that one. I would use the Take the Crown. Ooh, there it is. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now I'm going to get some eyes eyeliner. I'm gonna use I don't have a purple eyeliner, I don't think.
could probably not see it, but they're not crying. <laughs> Please just forgive me, guys. I feel like I'm the most pathetic right now. But I will continue to do what I like doing, which is doing this makeup and finishing. So now I'm going to have to get some, uh, let's see, I will do the mascara last. No, actually, yeah. Okay, so... I will have to do and get me some powder, powder my face. Hmm. So I won't look too, like, too, 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 too. I'm gonna use the Fit Me. I actually get the number 15, it's light. Um, Sophie does actually recommended this she likes it and i want to try it so let's see what i can get from this i'm going to use the bare mineral full flawless face face powder This is the one with the powder. And this is the one without a powder. <sighs> you know what? Today is just a trial day. I will get better eventually. I just could not. to do my inner eye It's been a long time. I am even crying. Okay. So next would be the bronzer. Where are my bronzers? I, I can't remember where my bronzers are. I was actually rearranging the whole 
clays and I could not seem to find a bronzer. Hmm. Wow, okay. So let's see. Sorry guys, bear with me for this bronze surge. Okay, I'm getting blush a little blush Let's see what they here Okay, so now we are going to put some mascara, 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 mascara.
Okay, so we got blush. We got... So now we just need to use some highlighter. And let's see if we can find some highlighting blush. Mm -hmm. Use that for highlighter blush. Is gosh, bright lash to shades of bone sorrow. Bless you.